you, you know what? There's, there's something that happened that's, again, absolutely, uh, absolutely real. Before the day I came on this trip, I'm making breakfast for the kids. I have, they put makeup on this tonight. I won't, I won't show it. It's a cut. It's been in the, it's the bald father's slam into the open cabinet that the kid left open. Cut. Only bald fathers know this. And it's the six things at breakfast. Don't hit him. No, he hit me too. All right, then hit him, but eat the fruit. And it's the, <laughs> it's the nine things at once and the bagging, the lunches, yeah. which I do really well. Yeah. I like that because it's something I can control in life. Anthony Hopkins in Remains of the Day had nothing on me. <laughs> it, it, you know, and I didn't even need a ruler. to. I put every fork in the right place. And the kids, no, don't do this, don't do that. And one of the kids had grabbed me. Daddy, I need the thing. Sure. The th Zam! And... It has to be 28 times now, about every two months, the ex to the millimeter, the exact same spot on my head, and then it bleeds, and there's a little just trick. It doesn't it hurts. It doesn't hurt. But the, the point is about comeuppance or crankiness. Yeah. In real life, I think the key to anyone creative, and I think most people, too, there are two kinds of people. One, when something like that happens, do you get angry? Do you get angry at the kids? The dog, the cabinet, anything else in life? You storm into the bedroom, you know, and say, that's it, we're getting new cabinets. You know, the answer is no. It, it depends how quickly can you laugh again in life? How quickly do you say to yourself, this is actually hysterical because how lucky am I? We've got a house, we've got food. You know, we have kids, my wife's back there. And you know what? I'm not, I didn't cut a hand off. Yeah. I did another silly life thing.